All right, we are back. Recording my second episode for today. Um, at a very light, late hour, because my internet went out. Yay! Um, was supposed to be streaming and playing Lost Ark. That that shit ain't happening. So I might as well be productive and record some more episodes then. Kinda sucks. It's a weekly reset today. So a lot of shit needs to be done. I was kinda hoping to catch a high level party going into Valton Hard, but that's not gonna happen. Unless I get the get my internet back within the next 35 minutes. We'll see. Anyways, enough of uh how I'm getting uh, completely uh screwed over by my internet provider. Ow! Were you guys sent by the internet provider to slap me in the face? Haven't you hurt me enough today? Burn. God's bless and reward you, Witcher. Though I can give you only a morris. God's bless and reward you, Witcher. Okay. Though I can give you only a morris. Probably find me somewhere, I'll give you my reward. Your reward is the right to spend money. Okay, well, let's stop delay. Let's go see what this is about. Put your sword away now, sir. That's the wrong button. How you like that silver? What's up with this messed up GPS? There we go. Oh, wait, that was something. Seems like we have to go fairly deep into this. Can't take it anymore. What's going on? Someone hit you? No, 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 quiet. Or oh, she'll hear. Who'll hear? My beloved. Beautiful as the morn and sweet as linen honey. Her grace, so delightful. <laughs> Don't seem all that delighted to me. Where is this beloved of yours? There in the depths. Sleep. Don't wake her by the gods! Okay, I won't make her. Wake her. Hello! Anyone home? Oh, a sweet heart. Fresh and scrumptious. Tell me a rhyme, then you'll get a prize. Or a beating. Huh. You're as lovely as... As what? As what? As rotten meat. And you're a monster. And I kill monsters. Alright, well that didn't last long. Ow. Gonna have a slap fight? <laughs> Who's the biggest bitch? I am. <laughs> My slaps are... Better than yours. Damn right. They're better than Wait, is that what the song is? Is bigger, better or bigger? I don't remember. <laughs> Wee. Huh. Bard ran off. Can't say I blame him. They lure me in. Well, that didn't work out, did it? Come here, cat. Seed. Oh, that's Whee. 
Nope. <laughs> Swings his sword. What is this GPS? Like, what the hell? Like, what the actual hell? <laughs> Why would you swap? I didn't even click to track the new one that we activated in there. And it doesn't even switch back to the original one that I had. Pollen on the leaves still. Someone picked the bloom recently. What are we looking for exactly? Dodging these strikes. I saw something here, something red. I don't know what that is. There we go. Aha. Uh -huh. Another seeker of Pimpernel. Another? Gremist has sent countless young druids into the forest. They emerge drained with a blank stare and with no flower. And they never speak of what happened. I've asked Gremis to stop the folly. He looked at me and laughed. But the fun's over. One of our novices, Ramond, has failed to return. I've come to find him, alive or dead. What do you know about this forest? Not much. Funny, isn't it? A druid should know every tree, every bush. But even we know not to venture to some parts of the isle. We can subdue animals, but not monsters. And the word is, one has made its lair here. A Leshen? An Axebrun? Sadly, I don't know. As I said, those who have entered do not speak of who or what they saw. Right. Let's figure it out. Listen, you're looking for a druid, I'm looking for a flower. Let's go in together. Why not? I could use the help of a tracker. Lead the way. Flower. No petals. Technically, I'm not a tracker. Flower. No petals. I'm a witcher. And I can track, but I'm not a tracker. Right? Hoof prints. But a bipeds. I think a hunter would be a better tracker. Or would you qualify witchers as hunters? Flower. No petals. Flower. Okay, enough. No petals. Flowers and petals. So not Leshen. Because Leshen has roots, right? You'd see uh, traces of roots and stuff. And also one of the, the totems that they put in their territory, right? I don't think they I don't think Leshens have layers from what I remember they have they mark their territory. And also they don't have hooves. <laughs> so here as well, but they've been picked. Every last one. Why are there two sets of hooves? The hell? It's one of those. Oh, let's kill it. Get over here. Quite the test, isn't it? Gonna do something, old guy? Alright. Did it just try to stab me with its penis? 
Thanks for help, buddy. Hey. Show me what you got. Booty smack. Oh, he got to summon his friends. No, never mind. Just the one. Back to Detective Geralt. Footprints. Some fresh, others faded. All leading in the same direction. It's a lot of footprints. Oh, no, no. Oh, stop. Please. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, this is great. No, no. Stop. <sighs> Please. Stop it, that tickles. <laughs> Two can play this game, you horny goat woman. Unhand him, hellish creature. Ramond, step away from her. Ah, calm down. I've not been harmed. I came here. You don't know what you're saying. She's cast a spell on you. Nonsense. I need no spell. These boys come here themselves. In fact, I must use magic to drive them away. Make them go home. Only Ramond was nice, so I let him stay. I see through your lies. Your wretched charm won't work on me. I shall kill you here and now, monster. She's a succubus, right? I Same as the first one. To kill her. She's a monster, sure, but a sentient one and basically harmless. No such thing. Just as there's no dry water, no cold fire. But if you'll not help, very well. I shall tend to her myself. I'd advise against it. I will return. With one who does not carry a sword for show. Why did you take my side? I'm afraid you'll be sorely disappointed. I don't generally couple with witches. Especially not out of gratitude. <laughs> why not? <laughs> How to girl. Tell me why not. Is it the scars? I detest when a man smells of blood. You witches always reek of it. Fiend blood, trot blood, and these are my brethren. You're right. But unlike fiends and chorts, you... Have ample breasts and a pretty face? I know. Their lack of these attributes, is that what makes them easy to kill? It's a bit more complicated than that. But never mind. No means no, I get it. Can't think of another way you can repay me. I'm looking for Pimpernel. You know this forest. Maybe you could help me. I shall take you myself. And you, Ramond, go pick some more violets. Just the indigo ones this time. Uh, indigo? You mean blue? No. Indigo is indigo. <sighs> Men. I wouldn't Why make a snarky comment flowers? about her Nobody sexism, but, uh... Wait and see. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not entirely sure what the difference between blue and indigo is. Um, is indigo lighter? Actually, do you know what? Although I don't have internet on my PC, I still have my mobile net on my phone. Indigo. Yeah, that just looks like blue to me. The dark blue. Blue violet ish dark color. From the plant Indigofera anil. I thought that was navy blue. Or king blue. Oh, I guess I'm just stupid when it comes to colors. Where'd you go? Why does the game keep... ...swapping the quest? Man? So yeah, I remember uh, running into a succubus uh, in... Uh, ...Novigrad, I think? I read the best story. Apparently they don't attack until they get attacked. They only attack in self-defense. Now, shoo! I await 
need someone. Okay. You were supposed to lead me. What? Now, shoo! I await someone. Alright. So all those druids, they went up here to get, you know... To get their, uh... What should we call it? Equipment... Tested. <laughs> I don't know how else to put it. I mean, I know how else to put it, but without being spanked in the face by... Uh, YouTube's algorithm. Interesting, interesting. Use your richer senses to pick pimp Pimpernel. There is none in here, right? Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Not gonna lie though, indigo was a nice color, at least on Google. <laughs> I like that color. I'm gonna make that my favorite color that I don't know how to pick out out of the range of blue. Every man on the continent so bloodless. All right. And look at this. Looks so nice. What the hell? Sometimes this game looks like today's quality the texture again because of the amazing lighting other times it actually looks like potato from five or six years ago it's a nice experience though okay cat where are you all right <laughs> sure why not oh wow look at that so good. Get up. Can cat do it? Yes, he can. Level twenty three all gold. Spikes are gonna hurt, but you just need some damage over time on them. There we go. <laughs> just fall over, please. There's something else up here. That's good, I thought it was a uh, earth elemental. Would take about 500 years. But this is gonna take some time too. Not gonna bother with oil. The time it's gonna take to get into the menu, find the auger oil, auger oil, and apply it. Cyclops won't bother me anymore. Might as well just look keep smacking. Peacefully now. All right, what we're we supposed to do here? Just get some logs or distilling recipes. Parchment's a little faded, but legible. I'm not gonna read it. 
Maybe I should have. Okay, you know what? I'll read it. Chalfa. Yalfa, Chalfa, Chalfi, whatever. Uh, I'm giving you one last chance. Either you do everything properly or your apprenticeship is over and you can start packing your bags. Here are your instructions. Read them twice to make sure you make it into the <laughs> make it into that watery brain of yours. Put the mash in the evaporator. Light the fire under the evaporator. Cool the condenser. First turn the right lever. Then the left. Not the other way around. Now, is that hard? No. The answer is no. So get to work. Dogfin. P.S. Don't toss rotten malt out behind the story. Dump it into the stream, otherwise someone will catch a whiff of something and come investigate. Alright. Wonder what that last part was about? Oops, I think I did it the right, wrong way. Okay, wait, hold on. I need to first put the moss in the evaporator. Is this the evaporator? No? Got lucky. Bit of mash left. Okay. Let me just make sure I'm doing it correctly. Put the mash in the evaporator, light the fire, first turn the right lever. Then. Okay. So we put it in. Here's where the mash goes, probably. Add mash. Just add the mash. What the hell? Where was it? Here's where the mash go. Terrific. Right there. Okay, what about this one? No. Maybe the mash goes into the evaporator up here. That's not what I wanted, but all right. Yes? <laughs> okay. I think I have to restart. Seems bugged. Who would have thunk? Here's where the mash goes, probably. Oh, there it is. Done. Now to boil the mash. And uh, I'm supposed to do something with a condenser, right? Light the fire under the evaporator. Then ought to be enough. Time to cool it down. Right, and then left. Okay. 
stellar. It's weird. <laughs> Like a spirit. All right, got that done. But before I head out, I want to check out these two things. Could do that later, honestly. But since we're here, let's do it. Okay, well, this is going poorly. Uh, well, we can try. Slide down, see what happens. Whee! Oh, wow. Oh, wow, we're going fast. And far. <laughs> Super wee! It's actually working. No, right, right, I mean, okay, left, left, uh oh, uh oh. Kinda worked. Aimed kinda poorly, but... I mean, we're here. <laughs> oh, please don't tell me I can't get... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I can do this, Geralt. Ah! Good... Oh. It's clearly not made for snow. Crap. Not to have a boat here, do you? Maybe I can just swim. Yeah, I, I can. Luckily, uh, the high temperature in the water doesn't affect them. So they won't uh, freeze up and drown. And just swim. Look at a map. See what's happening here. Oh shit, the armor. Okay, well. Jink Fred. <laughs> so, you change your mind? Wanna hunt the Rossbart brothers with me? Easy coin for you. Yeah, we can hunt them together. Grand! Let's get going then. I've picked up their trail, they shouldn't be far. Wait, I thought this was a quest to find the missing miners. A witcher, eh? Hey! I like the way. Not even gonna question them. Death it is. Went well, I thought. Maybe you'd consider working together for a spell. Seems you have a gift for this kind of work. Thanks. Once is enough. So long. I'll take the experience. And the free money. Sad tale of those guys. Didn't really get to experience actual tale itself, but whatever. Let's 
find this mark. Yes. Might want to look around some. Where are you? Diagram. Not in the mushroom, that's for sure. Done. Good for me. Let's go back and no, this is this. also I can talk to that shopkeeper. I should. Where is he? There are very few bees. The ground. Probably plays Gwent as well. Welcome to the sacred grove. Oh, what do you druids deal in these days? Looking for someone who'd know some master alchemist formulae. Then you're looking for Grammist? Where can I find it? Okay, well, we know where it is. And disappointing, no went by him. But that's okay. We're gonna play Gwent versus Grammist. Thick, leathery leaves, rough to the touch. Hello? Did everything you asked. Phenomenal, my boy! So, Fritjof, shall we begin? The sooner the better. We've a long night ahead of us. The ritual is only for members of the inner circle. Thus, my dear apprentice, you must wait outside. Under no circumstances must you enter. We shall begin your tutelage come morn. Will you finally tell me what the ritual's about? Nay, nay. No one likes a meddler. Suffice to say, it's a burning matter now. Shoot! <sighs> well, this is kind of wasting my time. Whee! Okay, I waited until the next day, maybe I have to wait 24 hours. So let's just go. Just to be sure. <laughs> we must have another. That's good stuff. Aye, as the bears from Moss Gordon and Spear from Hail Hell. Good times, <laughs> Fritjof. Good times. Finally, something other than damn potions and transmutations. Guess the ritual's not over yet. Good. I thought I told you to sh stay outside. Only dreads of the inner circle. Circle, smirkle. Let the boy have some fun. He's earned it. <laughs> Fine. Pour yourselves on. Good. Let the lessons begin. Drink hard and study hard. I like the idea. Yeah, yeah. I call it stimulation and assimilation. First you stimulate, and then... 
<laughs> you assimilate and shut down. <laughs> Let's start with ingesting toxins. Best approach, practice makes perfect. Mm -hmm. I've practiced a lot already. Good thing. I'll make learning my secret method easier. Look, you take the potion like this, and go. Who said old age is a burden? Okay. Anything I can steal from here? Nope. Well, let's play some Gwent. Better have a good card, sir. Better have a good card. Give me that. What do you want now? I taught you all I know. Gwent, ever play the game? If your question is, would I be interested in playing you? The answer is simple. No. Afraid of losing? I understand. Very well. I drove your deck. Win. And I'll give you my best card. You're very... Cool with giving away the best cards. I would never. <laughs> Okay, looking good. Oh. Wouldn't mind a dragon, but I've got some power cards here. An archer. So we're not going with the archer. I'll probably just play the fog before I. Oh. Get the fog going. I want to play the the spy card. Oh damn! And we have some cards. Okay, let's play this. Gives us some room to decoy and replay the spy. Coming down, probably. Maybe not. That's a dumb play. Play here. We don't have anything. <laughs> I have to play something. There we go. I kind of wish the dragon had killed something because I could have played this reanimator, gotten it into graveyard on the turn two, used the Enfer, got the reanimator, got a third card, I mean a second card. A little bit unfortunate. I know this gives it one more power. But my opponent passed, huh? Well, what I can do is actually play another spy. They go up to 54. I play this. Go up to 50, 55 and I win. This uh, card out of my head. There are whole four cards up together with a dragon and a bunch of stuff. Very nice. No good targets to revive though. Um, let's just play this out. Dragon is in the graveyard. They need to have Scorch or another dragon. Oh, wait, they can get it back now. Wait, what? A bad choice. 
That's an awful choice. I think. Unless they have another one. Yeah, okay, they have another one. Makes sense. Wait, what? Hey? Does he have a third reanimator? He does. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Good targets to bring back here. Yeah, I mean, whatever. Bring back a catapult. I mean, trebuchet. Let's wear him down. I'll play this on turn three. In uh, round three. I'll pass here. Either we win or we win the next one, <laughs> so it doesn't matter. Okay, never mind, it doesn't matter. The situation isn't that different. Okay, that actually, I did not expect that to happen. But that's okay. It was still a tricky situation for opponent to get out of. It's just quite a bit of power. And it's spread out as well. So. Even like, get this back. Get. Just for the hell of it, why not? Let's play it up. Oh crap, it's already 43 minutes. Maybe I shouldn't be wasting time. Yet here I am, wasting time. Let's see. Let's see what else we can draw. Uh, why not? And here we go. You won. I believe you're ready to challenge Madman Lugos. I do wonder if he'll agree to play you for his catacan. Mysterious elf. Don't I have a catacan? In my deck? I believe I do. Anyways, what did I get? Mysterious Elf. Probably in the Elf deck. Oh! That's a good one. Can't be bounced. It's pretty good. Oh well. Madman Lugos. Well, I will be doing that in the next episode. Anyways, I am going to end it here. And I'm going to go check my internet if it's back up. If it's back up, I'm going to see if I have time to play any Lost Ark tonight. If not, I guess I'll record another episode. I guess I'll have to be productive. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. And I'll see you in the next one. And bye.